Good morning guys. My name is the old mechanic. And welcome back in my shed. And what do we have today? Here in my shed. Well, I tested in the last two months this Anchor home battery. So this is not about motorcycles. This is about how you can lower your electricity bill without having sun panels. Hey old mechanic, how is that possible? Well, I am going to explain it to you later on. First, we have a look at the Anchor Solex Solar Bank 2 E1600 AC. And at this moment you get for free the Anchor Solex Smart Meter. First, we're gonna look at all the specs of this home battery. It is a 1.6 kilowatt battery. The output is 800 watts, so that's good. Now guys, another thing I want to show you. Over here is a power outlet. Suppose there is a, a power outage and you want to power your television or a light or whatever. Well, this. There are two clips underneath, one here and one over there. And then you lift it up and over there is an AC socket. So you can plug in an extension cord. But that's nice. You can use that socket to power devices. Maybe your television or a few lights. It's 1.6 kilowatt. So let's say your television draws 50 watt these days. It goes on easy. Or another device. That's good. And that's over here. Also, you live in an apartment and you have a balcony. You can place this one on the balcony. It has a rating IP65. So it's uh, uh, waterproof, dustproof. Wait a minute, guys. I'm going to place it over here. So I can read it while talking to you. It assures that it works reliable even outdoors. However, it's always recommended to install the unit in a location that provides some protection. Guys, it comes with a warranty covering the product 10 years. 10 years, keep that in mind. If you have solar panels, you can go up to 2000 watts on solar panels to feed this baby. Also good. Anchor has calculated that this battery can save you up to 954 euros a year. But guys, I think that's in the ideal circumstances. Let, keep that in mind. And it's 100% micro-inverter compatible. That is when you have solar panels on your roof with micro-converters. And then another thing. You can expand this. They also have optional batteries and you can easily stack them together to a total of, now listen, 9.6 kilowatt hours. So then you have a really a beast. And that's so easy, 
just buy the extra battery and stack it on top. There are connections underneath and it recognizes instantly there is an extra battery and the electronics in here start charging those batteries too. Um, what I like about that is that you don't need a lot of money right away. You can start buying this one first and then over time I'm not sure what they cost. In the description I make a link to the Anchor website so you can look it up for yourself. The next thing I want to tell you how to use this battery without having sun panels. Maybe you live in an apartment and you don't have access to a roof or you don't have a balcony. You still can use it to save money on your electricity bill. How does that work? Well guys, that's easy. My electricity provider has the option and that's called a dynamic electricity contract. And that means that I can look in the app and see what the cost is of one kilowatt each hour. So at this moment, I'm going to show you, my electricity price per kilowatt is 14 cents. 14. So, and the highest price today is at seven o'clock this evening, seven to nine. 31 cents per kilowatt. So guys, I charge it from the socket when the price is low and I discharge it to my home when the price is high. Easy. Buy electricity when the price is low and use that electricity when the price is high, because you have your Anker home battery. The machine also comes with an app and the app is absolutely great. You can program it to all kinds of different settings. Let's walk through a few. Opening the Anker app. Now you can see it's fully charged, 100%. It is, at this moment, mm, we call it hand warm. You can feel it that it's, it's not cold. Then we go to devices. Then you can see my anchor, this one. Here you can see what it's doing now. It's 39 degrees Celsius inside, so that's cool, 100% charged, and it's now on manual backup power. Now, over here, these all the selection modes you can choose from. The first thing is self-consumption mode, maximize your solar panel usage to gain energy independence. Now, this what I'm talking now is about that you don't have any solar panels. So. Then we have the custom mode. The custom mode, power output for different times of the day according to estimated power demand. Here you can set a schedule. Let's set a schedule. I want the unit to provide me with power uh, each day at in the evening at from seven o'clock. Then the price is seven, eight, the price is high. So then I want this baby to kick in. Eh? There we go. 
go 350 okay save suppose Wednesday evening you're away from home and that's every week on a Wednesday so you can say discharge the battery except for Wednesday hey clever that's what the custom mode is then we have the manual backup power and that means you can set a time that you want your battery to charge it from the grid now that's also easy guys starting time the date now let's say today okay it's today the 12th and we're gonna set it to what I said about 12 o'clock then the price is low okay save yes let's say we want to do this the one uh, until 29 okay so that's for the next four years and we want to the ending time set at 11.30 which is here 23.30 over there save see we set it save okay So this was my video about the Anchor Solix. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you do, give me thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. Hopefully see you the next time. And for now, Old Mechanic.